Yo, what it do, YouTube? Back again with another video. HVK all day. Let's get it, man. All right, I want to shoot a quick banger before the sun goes down. You know, I got that afternoon glow. Uh, basically, you know, the topic of today's video is going to be something that came to mind, something that I've been experiencing a lot today, and that is locking eyes with random women when you are retaining. Okay, like your eye contact, bro, it becomes ridiculous, man. On this journey, your eye contact is so strong. And it's just, it's weird, bro. It's like, I don't know, like, since women are, like, obviously, like, they're more in tune with energy, bro. You become, like, I don't know, man. You become, like, that walking loud pack. You know, when you're out in public, bro, retention gives you, like, the celebrity energy, man. I'm not even kidding because, you know, the majority of people out here, you know, they're drained you know they have no like energetic impact in the places that they go right retention changes a lot about you like physically mentally energetically right so when you're out in public man you know like your your physical appearance changes man because you start like carrying yourself in a more masculine way you know like naturally your body it just your body posture improves okay i might make a separate video on that on itself how your body posture improves um but yeah it does man like you just find yourself like walking with your head up your back straight your shoulders back you know you own the room all right so that's one of the things that has to do with it so that in itself right it catches people's attention but what i wanted to focus on in this video is like how sometimes you don't even have to be doing anything and you will find it's always women right because like i said they're more like the emotional uh like they're more receptive to energy right so when you are retaining your energy guys they could like pick up on this subconsciously or um energetically and you will find yourself just randomly locking eyes like with women you know just like er everywhere you go bro like you'd be in the store and since you're not like looking down like you you, you become very observant right that's what i've noticed like you become very observant uh, and I'm very aware of your surroundings <laughs> and like you find yourself like people just like just staring at you bro like it, it's not just women but it could also be like people in general but like like I said you know when it comes to like the female attraction on this journey it's very real you know I experience it all the time and it's, it's pretty bizarre bro like you can't help but laugh about the things that you you experience man because yeah, man, you just find yourself just like locking eyes with just like a bunch of random women. And it, it just gets like, I don't know how to explain it, but it's just, it's just funny. Like, it's almost funny to me because you just feel like you feel like Tupac, bro. All eyes on me. You know what I'm saying? But that's how it feels like, bro. Like, sometimes it's like overwhelming, too, you know, because you get like unwanted attention, right? You get like unwanted attention on retention y'all see the glow bro let's go man your eyes will your your eyes will freaking shine on this journey man like i feel like unreal right now um but yeah bro that they say the eyes are the window to the soul right the eyes are the window to the soul so you know this is a great benefit of of retention is you know your eye contact improves a lot all right all right it has like your eyes they hold a lot more energy behind them they hold a lot more power so when you lock eyes with women bro be careful because you will like turn them on bro <laughs> like i can't make this up man like you will make them feel some type of way if you hold that gaze right if you hold that eye contact and if you riz them up right like one thing is just like looking at them right noticing them like staring at you and stuff like that but if you actually talk to them bro you know, they will start cheesing, they will start feeling you, bro. Like, you could literally feel them, like, becoming, like, feminine around you. You know, women become very feminine when you're in your masculine frame, when you're confident within yourself. And this journey will get you there, bro. Like, SR is, like, the best thing that you could do for yourself as a man. It's, like, our natural state, man. It's not porn, guys. It's not natural at all. You know, I never really say the word itself. I, I usually call it corn, but yeah, man, I don't even like saying the word, but yeah, it's just, that's not natural at all. You know, it's not natural at all. It's keeping you in a very scarcity mindset, 
when you go out in public, whenever you see like a chick, you're going to feel intimidated. You're going to feel nervous, right? You're not going to feel confident because you're objectifying every single woman that passes by you, right? Instead of just being stoic, being cool, calm and collective and reading the type of women that, you know, like you interact with. Because that's another thing that I noticed is, you know, being on SR is like you see women differently. You know, you see them on like a more of on an energetic level like you could admire her beauty obviously but that's not gonna sway you in the wrong direction right if she looks good physically but she has like ugly energy that's gonna be like an instant turn off for you you're just gonna go the other way right because you're no longer controlled by lust okay the hub is it's what's keeping you in control like it's keeping it's what's keeping uh your life like very lustful but when you get rid of that, guys, and when you start to retain, you start focusing your energy on better things. The female attraction is just a byproduct of of the work that you've been putting in on yourself. All right. You get the spiritual glow, man. It's not just physical. It's spiritual as well, guys. Like like your energy just becomes like unreal. You know, you have very high energy. Your aura is just your presence is basically felt everywhere you go. You have like this celebrity energy. Um, and like I said, sometimes it's just like ridiculous, bro. Like you feel like, like, I don't know, like how to explain it. But like you get unwanted, att uh, unwanted attention and you're not even like looking for it or anything like that. It just happens, bro. It's just, you know, you start looking healthier. You got the spirit of God all over your face, bro. You know, like all over your aura, just physically, energetically, you know, the, the light within you. Is basically shining outwards that's basically what i'm trying to say with that but you know locking eyes with random women guys it would just catch you off guard sometimes you know it would just catch you off guard because you just be chilling minding your own business this literally happened today while i went uh shopping you know i went uh shopping for some vegetables or some eggs or something like that and while i was in there guys like i felt like i don't know bro it was so weird but like within five minutes there was like three different girls you know three different girls that all of a sudden I, I catch them like staring or we just randomly like just lock eyes and we're just like like <laughs> i don't know bro it's just so weird bro like you know what i'm saying it's just so weird you know like if you are retaining yourself man you know you experience like a bunch of funny things man like like you're literally on a higher vibration than most guys out here because you know, corn, the hub, that fapping bullshit and other bad addictions keeps people at a very lower state, like energetically, you know, they're like, it keeps them like zombies, like walking zombies out here. You know, they have no life force within them. They're spiritually drained. So, you know, women aren't really going to respect those type of guys. But yeah, man, it's just like it's, this journey is definitely like a blessing, guys, you know, like. I made so many videos on this topic, but, you know, I, I just keep, you know, like speaking on what whatever comes to mind. Right. Because this is very important knowledge that people should know about. And it's helping a lot of people uh, become aware about this. Right. Like, I feel like in the future, obviously, more people are going to learn about this. But, you know, for the people that are already practicing SR, you're ahead of the game. You already know what's up, bro. You already know how it goes, okay? So um, that's basically all I wanted to talk about, man. I kind of, you know, went all over the place, guys. But, you know, the energy is high. Uh, sometimes it's too high to even record a video, bro. Like, I can't even make this up, man. But, yeah, I just wanted to talk about that real quick. It's just locking eyes with random women, you know, or just feeling like a celebrity when you're out in public. You know, it's ridiculous, but that's that's basically it you know let me know your experiences with this um another thing is uh you have to be careful with these chicks that have boyfriends because they will stare at you too you know they will stare at you too and um yeah you don't want to turn into mr mr steal your girl <laughs> nah i'm just playing guys but yeah i mean i'm not playing i'm playing about that part but you know women with boyfriends will like look at you and stuff like but you're not even like entertaining that right just stay in your lane and let them admire but you know don't get involved with 
women in relationships or things like that that's just terrible okay um you know attract the women that you want to attract in your life right you don't have to go out looking for it that's another thing that i thought about too is like retention it opens up like so many more options when it comes to like women and stuff but at the same time it's kind of like a paradox you know you have like all these options of women that are giving you choosing signals but you know you become more selective than ever in who you choose because you start feeling happier like in your own energy and you don't need anybody outside of you to make you feel good about yourself right you're not out here just looking to just smash anything that walks right you you want to you want more of a connection right you want more something more like on a deeper level than just that lust right because once you like i said guys once you remove that lustful spirit out of your life man it just changes the way that you see everything you know you see life in in a totally different way man in a totally different way you start feeling way happier way more energy way more focus mental clarity that's a bar <laughs> like today at work guys i was just going hard bro you know i was just freaking doing things effortless man you know effortless it felt like i had like an infinite battery you know it's like a you know like a battery how it just keeps draining like like 70 percent 60 percent bro it felt like my battery was at 100 percent all day today you know you have these days on sr where your energy is extremely high and i think it's the weather too man like the sun it'd be charging us up man especially with this new earth with this new type of vibration that the earth is like <laughs> like facing right now guys like you definitely feel it and if you've been healing if you've been you know on sr living sober just do living the righteous lifestyle man you're gonna feel this a lot more intense right so you're just gonna be out here just like super sane mode you know but yeah i just wanted to talk about that real quick you know um yeah that's basically it guys i'm gonna just wrap it up with that so i hope you guys have a good day and i'll see you guys in the next one Peace.